Hello once again, YouTube. Welcome to episode 15 of Axa Plays Dragon Age 2. In the previous episode, I had just talked to Isabella and the Varric and the Hanged Man. And now I'm going to meet. Actually, yes, I am going to meet her, aren't I? Do, 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 do. Right, something outside the chantry. Blah, blah, blah. Meeting someone at, at night. Which I think is that one. Yes, yeah, so I'll go to Isabella's mission. Hawk and learned, uh, learned up to two specializations, one at level 7 and one at level 14. Each specialization offers a unique bonus and a new school of spells or talents. Kirkwall Knights aren't safe. Always some group of thugs around. Someone will usually pay for their removal. Yeah. Though. There's always some group of thugs. Wait, this is not what... Ooh. Just one I've always wanted a ring. Yeah. Um, this way. Hello, Isabella. There you are. I've been here for hours. Hader hasn't shown up. No one has. I don't like this. That's the wench we're looking for. Doesn't look a man. Got her. Okay, let's go. Oh, uh, Oh, this woman takes a beat. Hader sent them. Search the bodies. I need to find out where he is. Okay. Hader's letter. Hiding in the chantry and sending thugs to finish me off. Coward. What a poo saying. Come on. Let's go attack. Oh, no sacra. Wait, what? Shush. No, Jack. No. Follow. Follow. Okay. Yes. Ah, more enemies. Do this again sometime. Why? Why would I possibly want to do this again? Right. Okay, in the chantry I go. The Canari live on Parvalen, an island nation in the tropical northern climes. Some believe they originally came from the elsewhere, since they weren't seen in Thales until 300 years ago. It is true. Isabella, should have known you'd find me here. Tell your men to burn the letters next time. Castillon was heartbroken when he heard about the shipwreck. You should have let him know you survived. It must have slipped my mind. <laughs> Where's the relic? Yeah, the relic. I lost it. Castillon's just going to have to do mm. without. Lost it? Just like you lost a ship full of valuable cargo. Yes. They weren't cargo, Hader. They were people. They? Hmm. Those slaves were worth a hundred sovereigns a head. And you let them scurry off into the wilds. And now the relic's gone, too. Castillon won't be happy to hear that. I promise you. He won't be. Hmm. What are you talking about? We can work this out. Castillon, Castillon needs to cheer up. Castillon won't hear about it. What are you talking about? Will someone explain what's going on? Isabella's been a very bad girl. Ruined a perfect business deal and then ran away. She didn't tell you. I told him enough. I said I arranged for a duel, which I did. I also said you wouldn't play fair, which you didn't. 
We can talk later if you want. Right now, we have other problems. We can work this out. Castillon needs to cheer up. Castillon won't hear about this. You don't have to tell Castillon about Isabella. If I cross him, he'll have me killed. And my life is worth more than hers. Fair enough. There's only one way to settle this. To the death. Oh, she's a slow metal. Oh, charming. I thought it was going to be him, which would have made more sense. But it did. No. I swear to God, that character just said crispy dog. Chinese. Not your bitches. I was trying to talk him down. Yeah. Trust me, it's better this way. Castillon won't hear about me from Hader, but he'll find me eventually. I just have to get him the relic. It's simple as that. That's a lot of blood. Investigate. Castillon? Who is Castillon? He's a powerful merchant based in Antiva. I believe he has ties to the Felicissima Armada. I used to work for him. The jobs mostly involved smuggling lyrium, jewels, or the occasional criminal acquaintance. He paid well. Oh, uh, Hader mentioned human What's cargo. this about you freeing slaves? I was asked to escort Castillon's cargo ship. I got a bad feeling about the job partway through. Boarded the ship to find slaves. Nearly 200. Elves, humans, children even. It was sickening. They paid Castillon to take them away from the Blight. He took their money and sold them into slavery. Even I can see that's wrong. I was going to say, he sounds like a nice fella. Why the relic? What's so interesting about the relic? I don't really know what it is, except that it's ancient and worth my weight in gold. Castillon has me chasing it down as payback for freeing sounds his like slaves. Sounds like something I want. <sighs> to be honest, I think he just wants me dead. But that would be letting me off easy. Lucky tried to find the relic. You hired Lucky to track down information on the relic. That's right. He insisted he knew everything that was going on in Kirkwall. He lied. <laughs> I bet he doesn't even know everything going on in his pants. That makes no sense. You were shipwrecked? Did you end up in Kirkwall because your ship was destroyed? There was a storm. The ship ran aground on the reefs near the city. I managed to make it to shore. Most of my men weren't as lucky. Poor sods. Just like lucky. I knew some of those men almost ten years. Ah, oh, balls. Balls. I can help you. Forget Castillon. If getting the relic gets Castillon off your back, then I'll help you retrieve it. And then sell it. I still don't know where Shh. it is, but you'll be the first to know if I hear anything. Anyway, thanks for helping me out with Hader. Not a problem. I think I'll tag along for a while. There might be something I could do for you. But I, I didn't say you were invited. And I have a room at the Hanged Man if you're looking for company later. Okay. Sounds like my kind of plan. Wait, what? Um. Do I want a rogue? No, not when she's exactly the same as me. So I'm going to stick with my mage. I already had them selected. Isabella's contact. There we go. Speak to Isabella in Lowtown's Hanged Man Pub. Okay. I think I wants to go to High Town first. 
I think. I think. Someone's always trying to claim the streets. If you make them safe to travel at night, someone will reward you. Like who exactly? Um, we've got the bone pit, Sunder Mount. Isn't that any messages? Uh, wait, the ha was, was it the hanged man? Yeah, probably. I can't remember. <laughs> she just told me I can't remember. That is stupid. Oh, yeah, I see it. Hello, Isabella. Mm, Ron. Maker. I think he's ignoring me now. Who? Who is? Hey! Barman. Is my coin not good enough for you? Oh, Hawk. Thanks for helping me with that little problem I had. You going to buy me a drink to celebrate our victory? No. I don't know if that's wise. Oh, please. Fixating on what's wise makes you forget what's fun. Oh, before I forget, are you still looking for work? Because I have a friend who needs some help. Always willing to help. A friend? I'm not a charity. A friend of yours is a friend of mine. What can I do? God, I'm a You didn't sucker. say, and I didn't ask, but I'm sure you're up to it. His name's Martin. He has a room right here in The Hanged Man. Tell him I sent you. Now, you going to leave me to my drinking or what? Every time someone says the name Martin, I instantly think of the Emperor from The Elder Scrolls Oblivion. Did I hear correctly? You are an abomination. Yes, thank you. Why don't you shout? I don't think everyone heard you. Do you see yourself as harmless then? An abomination who would never harm anyone? Like ripping someone's heart out of his chest. Yeah. I did that at the behest of no demon. So we agree that it doesn't take a demon for someone to be a vicious killer. <laughs> Good. Good. Say what? Oh, who's this? Who's it? It's Martin. It's Martin. Hello, Martin. So you found me. Going to finish Martin off properly this time, are ya? Where's my property, eh? How does it feel making a profit off someone else's hard work? Can I help with your troubles? Good. What? What? Uh, watch who you're accusing, Biatch. I'm not here to kill you, but if you tell me what this is about, I might be able to help. You're not here to kill me, and you want to help? Breaker, it's got to be my lucky day. I need someone to help me find out where the raiders have hidden my stolen cargo. No, this job's as easy as a peg-legged tavern wench. And there's good coin in it to boot. Are you saying she's a slag? Wait, what? Were you a raider? That's the cargo. How did you lose the cargo? You mentioned raiders? Pfft. Uh, can't you do this yourself? You have a history with the raiders, don't you? Yes. I was a raider. Back then it was just smuggling and petty thievery. It's changed since that madman Ianto took power around uh, here. Ianto. Extortion, murder, kidnapping. He does it all. It's just not to my taste. I tried to get out, but he didn't like that. This scar on my neck, he gave it to me. Slit my throat and threw me overboard. I tried to start Lovely. a new life away from this bullshit. And he has his men chase me down and steal my cargo. <laughs> and you're perfectly innocent of wrongdoing, aren't you? <laughs> uh, what's the cargo? Why would the raiders want your cargo? Is it valuable? How should I know why they want it? It's just spices and herbs. Nothing special. How did you lose it? What did the raiders do to you? They closed in on my ship. And forced her into the cliffs. My crew and I barely made it out alive. They yes. must have salvaged the cargo when it washed ashore. You mentioned raiders. Are the raiders a big problem around here? There are always raiders on the seas, just like there are always bandits on the roads. But they've been much more active of late, like vultures taking advantage of the blight. Can't you do this yourself? It's your cargo. You look for it. Those raiders are still looking for me. I'm not going to draw their attention. 
Fine, I'll help. I'll take care of it. You'll need to look around the docks. The crates bear the seal of the Orlesian Port Authority. So you'll know it when you see it. You can count on me. I'll find your cargo, Martin. You have my word. And my sword. I've had it with the Raiders. And, and this cargo is the key to me getting on the straight and narrow. You're doing me a huge favor here, friend. Thank you. And be careful. I can't go in the chest. Let's go in the door. A barrel. Barrel of laughs. And a car fragment. It really gets on my tits how you can't. My barrels don't glow. Everything else does, but barrels. Oh, no. No, sir. Upstairs. Mm, what do you say? Oh, see, so yes. You were the last man in the free marches. Close. Yes, finders keepers. Blah blah blah. Finders keepers. So, there must be mages in Tevinter who don't use blood magic. Of course, there are slaves. The magisters do not hesitate to collar their own kind. But no magisters. Why must you go on about this? No magister would turn down an advantage over his rivals. If he did, he'd be dead. You know, to use blood magic, you need to look a demon in the eye and accept his offer. I just figured some of them would say no. For aesthetic reasons, if nothing else. Okay. Hello, Mr. Longshore man. I'm looking for some cargo. You're in luck. Cargo all around. Take your pick. Well, that was rather sarcastic, wasn't it? Can you help me? How unique. Shut up. I could use your assistance. I'm looking for crates sealed by the Orlesian Port Authority. I haven't seen any. Sorry. Well. Talk to the Arbor Master. I'll bet he's got information about your cargo. He's in his office. At least one of them was kind. Thank you. Right. Hello, a badly copied leaflet. Blah, 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 blah. Take back all Watch out by the cavalry You're not the harbour master. If you see a blonde elf girl, run. But you are. She's probably a blood mage. Oh, correct. Shipping manifest. I have an inquiry. I'm looking for cargo bearing the seal of the Orlesian Port Authority. Ugh. Adam, deal with this. I apologize on Liam's behalf. He is a very, very busy man. I'm Adam, the Harbour Master's assistant. I understand you're looking for Orlesian cargo. That I am, oh, my good man. I've seen the crates. I can't remember where. Such a shame. What do you want? Get to the point. The clink of gold coin often jogs my memory. <laughs> this might help. Or fear will help you remember. This is ridiculous. They say your life flashes in front of your eyes before you die. You're not going to kill me in broad daylight. No one's that stupid. Oh, that went badly. I'm not paying for this. Then I am deeply sorry I could not be of more assistance. Good day. You son of a bitch. There's a memory in this head waiting to be unlocked. Fine. Actually. I'm not. Then. Can I actually do it without it? Force the harbour master to blah blah blah. Fuck's sake. There's a memory in this head waiting to be unlocked. Is this enough to help you remember? No. Ah, it's coming back to me. The cargo is in Alton Woodrow's warehouse, by the dock. I'm glad we could help each other out. I hate you. Two crates, you bastard. Right, well, thank you for watching, and I'll see you again next time.